this is the difference between receiving a download and going off of like what you learn, egoic. Ego is reading a book. That's the ego. So basically, you're just reading hand down knowledge that could have been fabricated. That's the difference. So I want to tell you all that. So books are very great. I do agree in books. Like, hell, I got a book right here. You feel me? I'm using it as a holder right now at the moment, but I got a book. You feel me? Hold on. Let me just fix this for y'all. What does it say? Handbook Osteopathic Technique. You guys got to understand your body. You have a body. Everyone has a body. I ain't going to talk too much about this because it's all about downloads versus ego. But everyone has a body. This is what I spent like years studying and practicing and just doing, spending my time doing every single day. But everyone has a body, right? The moment you realize, the moment you realize how to biohack your body, meaning how you unlock, you release certain technique, mechanism, just like in the video game, an RPG game, you know, World of Warcraft, you leveling up, they're biohacking their body. So if you a gamer, you know what I'm talking about. I used to be a huge gamer. I still am, but I'd rather experience it physically than, you know, be playing the game because I used to be playing games like 10 hours a day. Like when I first woke up to like four in the morning every day, me and my bro, me and my foster brothers and sisters, me and hell, homies that I used to chill with. So my point is everyone has a body. This is very good to understand from a book, but you do not want to rely on that alone. So the difference between the Akashic downloads is you're getting downloads from all the knowledge that has ever been um, thought. Yes, because your, your thoughts go out into the collective consciousness, which is the uh, Akashic, which is basically just a stream of like information. That is what life force energy is. It's just it's just thoughts, consciousness, okay? It's just constantly moving. It's moving right now. That's why thoughts move faster than your words. Actually, what's much more faster than the speed of light is your thoughts. Your thoughts travel instantaneously. It has no, it can move in any formation, any direction, at any, just the, depends on the energy intent behind it. So when you're, when you're uh, going off your thoughts, you're going to typically get it from the, uh, it can be from ego or Akashic, but when you rely on your thoughts, your thoughts is always creating. So you want to make sure those thoughts persist from or come from like a higher state of consciousness so it can't be wrong it's factualized so basically you're getting your information from the akashic versus books because what would be the worst thing to do is to spend your years learning something mastering something to find out that it's wrong can't get that time back i know to spend all that time learning and researching and indulging yourself and endowing yourself and thinking you're a master now at your craft and AKA me with the gym, because I used to go to the gym like six, seven hours every day. And, you know, I was, you know, a chiropractor. So I basically broke and released decalcification blocks in the body. I still do this. But my point is, I did it more admin. Ever since COVID, I haven't really been because I don't really, you, know, you have to be a high. I have to know you take care of yourself for me to do further assist on your body. So I have to like break down, decalcify, flush out any blockages, flush out, uh, get your blood flow flowing again, decrease LDL, get the good fats going in there, flush out parasitic parasites because everything is in your hands and your feet. So the moment you do certain re, 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 uh, re, ah, reflexology on your body, you flush out, you heal emotionally, spiritually, and mentally. So anything that is from like childhood that's bothering you, that just means you need to flush it out of your body. It's it's stagnant in your body. So you, the moment you let it out of your body, you will let it go. You won't be still still pertaining in the old no more. That's why it's very important because I had to do a lot of shadow work still. Still shadow work. Every day I'm learning shit. Like, and I've been doing this for like more than 10 years. So my point is, when you're getting information from the Akashic, you're going to be working on things that is more important. I know. Because divine, aka collective conscious, I don't know what to call it because I, I realize that word God is has been fabricated. You're basically, you're giving your energy into these deities. That's what you're doing. I know. Yeah, I don't want to say too much because people get a little sensitive about that. I ain't trying to do all that. But yeah, it's like divine consciousness. It's 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 the spark, okay? That's how I re realize God is. God is the spark, okay? And that spark 
pertains in mostly everybody. That's who, so let's, let's put it like that. So that's God's consciousness. And that's what makes certain individuals gods walking around. And you know what I'm talking about. If you still hold this vibration, then you are. If you still believe. If you are watching this video, then yes, you hold that spark. You have God's consciousness inside you. Because if you didn't, you wouldn't be drawn to watch these kind of videos. Because this is all uplifting. This is factualized. I'm not, I ain't trying to uh, program you with no low. I ain't trying to put no low 440 uh, hertz in you. I ain't trying to put no 808. That shit. And all that shit, you got to know about that. But I ain't trying to do none of that. It's all about self-realization and releasing the old. That's it. There ain't no lay. I don't care what you say. You can look in my eyes. If a cat can't look in your eyes while they talking, nah. But don't let your guard down because they're going to try to play nice or sympathy card so that way they could get in on you. And then that, that way they could uh, get their foot in there. Nah, don't, don't. That's why I said... The Akashic will tell you everything. It's a download. It's a, your antennas will pick it up so you can receive it any moment, the moment. But you got to stay grounded. That's why it's so crucial that you stay grounded. You work out. You keep your body clean. You flush out stuff. You constantly uh, decalcifying, uh, oxygenating your muscles, your meridians, because everything is ruled by veins, right? Tunnels. If anything gets blocked, any air bubbles, your whole body, your whole body takes a toll. Everything. Everything. That's why it's so important to know about your body. Your body, because no one is going to tell you about your body better than you can. Hell, I will, but most people won't because they're trying to gain something from you. So they will want to hurt your body so that way they can charge you and overcharge you and have you as like, you know what I'm saying, a consistent client. Because those are the ones, who, you know what I'm saying, trainers, we, we, you know what I'm saying, I was in Cali, but the, man, the game was just too far. Man, they was, you got to have like, you got to be linked in. You got to have like a group of people that mess with you. You feel me? So what I'm telling you is, I won't get off too much topic, but so which is why now if you guys want to pick up from the Akashic, you guys got to do all these things. I'm going to tell you guys what you should do to be able to pick up all the messages and downloads from the Akashic records. I know. Who would tell y'all that? If y'all want to... If y'all want to know the secrets, y'all, just check out my Cash App and my PayPal. You don't got to, but I'm going to tell y'all in the next video. But I would really appreciate anybody showing some love. You already know. So I'm going to tell y'all that in the next video, okay? All right, I'm going to end this one. Peace.